Hello friends and welcome to AK Agrawal Aptitude Series. Friends, in this session we are going to learn a technique for solving a problem on linear arrangement. Here the given problem is 6 lectures A, B, C, D, E and F are to be organized 1 lecture per day in a span of 7 days from Sunday to Saturday. The given conditions are A should not be organized on Thursday, C should be organized immediately after F there should be a gap of two days between D and E. One day there will be no lecture. Friday is not that day. It means Friday lecture will be there. And just before that day, D will be organized. It means just after D, there will be no lecture. Okay. B should be organized on Tuesday and should not be followed by D. After B, D should not be there. So, based on this information, we have to answer which lecture is scheduled on Friday. So, friends, whenever such types of questions are being asked, always there are 2, 3, 4 or sometimes even 5 questions are. So, first let us analyze this data Monday to Sunday to Saturday 7 days. Let us make this small table. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday and Saturday 7 days schedule. Now, based on the given information, let us complete this table. A should not be organized on Thursday. This is Thursday. A should not be organized on Thursday. Okay, let us write A and cut it. A is not on Thursday. Okay. C should be organized immediately after F. But where F is there, where C is there, we don't know. So, let us highlight this and let us write F and C, they will be together wherever they will be F and C because C should be organized immediately after F. Okay. There should be a gap of two days between D and E. But where is D, where is E, we don't know. But there must be a gap of two days. So, let us write here D and E. D and E, there must be a gap of two days okay one day there will be no lecture friday is not that day one day there will be no lecture friday is not that day okay one day there is no lecture but friday lecture is scheduled yes we write it yes it means friday there is a lecture it is it cannot be the off day or holiday and just before that day d will be organized it means immediately after d there will be no lecture just once let us read it again one day there will be no lecture friday is not that day just before that day it means when there is no lecture d will be organized it means just after d there will be no lecture just after d there is no lecture okay so let us write it here last statement is b should be organized on tuesday and should not be followed by D. It means B is on Tuesday and on Wednesday D cannot be there. Okay. Now, let us complete this table. If we see F and C, they will be together. They can occupy this position, this position or this position anywhere. So, still it is not clear how to fill F and C. If we see D and E, there should be a gap of two days. Means this is a block of four lectures d no lecture lecture and e lecture d cannot be on wednesday so obviously these four days cannot be occupied this position d cannot be on tuesday d cannot be on tuesday because already b is there d cannot be on monday because if d is on monday just after d there is no lecture so d cannot be on monday so d is on sunday and just after d there is no lecture on monday then tuesday some lecture that is b and on wednesday e is there so in this manner this information is being incorporated in this tabular format now three places are left three places are left a f and c f and c are together f and c are together thursday there should not be a but either f may be there f may be there or c may be here but where will be a because f and c c should be organized immediately after f so if f and c here only one position is left because if f is here c will be here then a will be here which is not permitted because a cannot be on thursday so a will be at saturday and thursday and friday will be f and c so which lecture is scheduled on friday it is c 
फ्रेंड्स थैंक यू वेरी मच फॉर वॉचिंग दिस वीडियो यू कैन ऑल्सो फॉलो मी ऑन फेसबुक थैंक यू